Later that day, they had a battle of the bands where the NMSU band showed up and the Utah State band showed up. They played songs against each other and there was a winner drawn later. Uh, it was a great time. We interviewed the cheerleaders for both teams. Uh, they showed some of their acrobatic skills. There was a lot to do for the fans. There were all kinds of rides and foods and drinks. It, it, was, it was awesome. This is what it looked like. Our look lives were in there as well. It went pretty much all night. Okay, Trevor, you're good. That's what I gathered uh, from what they were saying. Your name was Joe, but can we have uh, your full name and can you spell it also? Yes, Joseph Freundlich. It's J-O-S-E-P-H, last name F-R-E-U-N-D-L-I-C-H. Uh, it's been a long time since uh, NMSU went to a bowl game. Uh, I assume you were not born 57 years ago. When you came to NMSU, did you think they would get to a bowl game? Um, Anyone who goes to support their school and wants them to go to a bowl game, I think that they've been making the proper um, steps in order to make it here, and they've been working hard. I've been here for about four years, and you know, seeing them progress for throughout those four years has been an awesome thing. Um, I think that they're more motivated than they've ever been, so they deserve to be out here. They've been working hard. What's been the best part for you personally about just this week here in Tucson? This week in Tucson, just seeing like all the different things that they send us to, like uh, we did the hospital the other day, one of our appearances that we do, um, seeing all the people, fans and uh, people who are hyped up for this game, it really makes a difference because uh, like, New like you said, New Mexico hasn't been there for a while and um, it's just really nice seeing how excited everyone else is out to be here and working hard watching them. Can I get a, a score prediction for tomorrow's game? Uh, I don't know about score, but I know that New Mexico State Aggies are going to win. That's for sure. Perfect, man. Appreciate it. All right, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> All right, Pistol, uh, tell me what is going to happen on the field when New Mexico State meets Utah State? Oh, of course, man. We're going to take on U Utah, and we're going to win. What have you uh, enjoyed the most about this week so far? I actually went to a children's hospital yesterday, and we got to hang out with all the little kids and kind of got to brighten their days up, and they were fantastic, big Aggie fans. What's the vibe like around, uh, you know, cheerleaders, and you, I assume it's pretty positive, pretty confident about tomorrow, right? Oh, heck yeah, it's been 57 years in the coming, so we're we're ready for this. After 57 years, you guys can't lose, right? I mean, that, that can't happen, right? Oh, heck no, not to Utah, we can't. <laughs> Have you met, uh, I guess you're hanging out with the, the Utah State cheerleaders and mascots, they're, they're decent people, right? Oh, heck yeah, they're super nice, down-to-earth people. But you got to beat them. Of course. <laughs> Appreciate it, Matt. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> the light looks good, though. When it... Actually, can you step a little bit closer? Is that okay? Yeah. I'll just keep my arm down. Tumbling in the background, Tony? <laughs> okay, Trevor. Okay. Uh, first thing, just really quick, can I have you say and spell your first and last name? Yeah, my name is Lila Islas. First name L Y L A and then I S L A S. Okay, so everyone in. Uh, okay, so hold on. You're trying to oh, duck into here. Don't do that. Oh, you gotta okay. get that sign. That's okay. she's, she's trying to get out. She's trying to get the shadow on her face. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, know, I know it's tough, but we just need that light, so. It'll be fast. Okay, so it's been a, a long time coming for Aggies fans. What is the prediction for tomorrow? Um, I'm hoping that the prediction for tomorrow is we just kill it, we go out there, and we win this bowl game that we've been waiting years and years to be a part of. What was it like cheering for this team all year long, knowing that you know this this was a possibility for this team? Um, it was really exciting. It was a really exciting season, knowing that they've been doing better and that there's a possibility that we could have been in a bowl game. So it was just each game was more energetic, a lot more exciting than the previous. How has Tucson been treating you guys so far? I love Tucson. I'm actually, I was born and raised here, so being here with the team and being here with like my, my family from New Mexico is just a really great experience. So you must have been pretty excited when they, they announced the bowl and said that they were coming here, right? Yeah, yeah. I was really excited that it was going to be in Tucson, Arizona, because I was like, oh, my family gets to go. Like, it's my hometown. It's going to be really cool. How was uh, your interacting with the uh, the enemy over here, the oh, Utah really? State? They're really nice. They seem very friendly. It's really cool to be hanging out with them, too. But on the field tomorrow, you guys still got to win. Oh, of course. We're going to win. Got to win. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah, of course. Thank you so much. Thank you can you get know. out of the sun now. I know.
Yeah. All right, so just so you know, we're uh, we're from the the other team, but we want to talk to you guys. Oh, right. I know. But <laughs> uh, first thing, just really quick, can I have uh, both of you just say and spell your first and last name? Yeah, I'm Kendra Sutton, K-E-N-D-R-A-S-U-T-T-O-N. And I'm Katie Bokett, K-A-D-I-E-B-O-W-C-U-T-T. -T. Okay, so what do uh, NMSU fans, what do we need to know about the great people at Utah State? We're awesome. We have such great school spirit. A ton and of spirit. And all, all the time at football games, the boys surprise me. Every football that game, they like try harder and work better. They come out and strong. Try, yeah, they do. Especially like after halftime, you can tell they've been like super pumped. And then they just go for it. Yeah. yeah. Now, uh, so, so far, everyone I've talked to, granted, they've all been from New Mexico State. But they all said New Mexico State's going to win. What do you oh. think? No. Utah State Utah all the way. State. I mean, of course Let's the go Aggies, blue. but go blue. <laughs> Definitely Utah State. Yeah. Now, both teams are the Aggies. Is it, is it weird hearing them talk about the Aggies, but they could be referring to a different team? Yes, sometimes. We kind of have to stop ourselves from saying, go Aggies. Because Catches us off guard a little bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it's so, fun. Go Utah State. <laughs> How's uh, Tucson uh, been treating you guys oh, so far? It is so warm here. We're loving Can the sun. You? Yes. There's no snow and it's beautiful. <laughs> yeah. So it's Logan, Logan, Utah, right? What what is the weather like there? Pretty sure it's snowing right now. Yes. There's no sun <laughs> ever from the months of like November to March. No yeah. sun, <laughs> just snow. Yeah. Yep. So when they announced that uh, the team was going to be coming to Tucson, I imagine you guys were welcoming of that. Yeah, the first thing we did was check the weather, and it said 80, 75, and I think I cried because I was so happy. Yeah, it's a beautiful city. We were excited to come. Mm -hmm. Perfect. I really appreciate it. Oh, thank you, thank you guys so nice for the time. You Very nice meeting you. And best of luck. Thank you. <laughs>
what's the vibe like around uh, you know cheerleaders and you I assume it's pretty positive pretty confident about tomorrow right oh heck yeah it's been 57 years in the coming so we're we're ready for this after 57 years you guys can't lose right I mean that that can't happen right? oh heck no not to Utah we can't <laughs> Have you met, uh, I guess you're hanging out with the, the Utah State cheerleaders and mascots. They're, they're decent people, right? Oh, heck yeah, they're super nice, down-to-earth people. But you got to beat them. Of course. <laughs> Appreciate it, Matt. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, <I> <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> the light looks okay, good, though. When it... okay, okay. Actually, can you step a little bit closer? Is that okay? Yes. Yeah. Keep my arm down. <laughs> Tumbling in the background, Tony? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Trevor. Okay. Uh, first thing, just really quick, can I have you say and spell your first and last name? Yeah, my name is Lila Islas. First name L Y L A and then I S L A S. Okay, so everyone in. Uh, you're trying to oh, duck into oh, here. Yeah. Don't do that. Oh, you okay. gotta get that sign. That's she's, she's trying to get out. She's trying to get the shadow on her face. Yeah.